Grandma 2K and I'm coming at you today sis with a new wig review. The unit we're going to be looking at today is from Outre. It is from the perfect hairline, my favorite hairline and it is one of the newest drops. Her name is Freya. This is what Miss Freya looks like. I'm actually wearing her. You guys, I have so much to say. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead, show you exactly what I did to obtain this look. And I'm going to tell you what Outre says about her and then give you my thoughts. If you are a Weezette, hey girl, hey. Thanks for coming back. I love and appreciate you guys. If you are new here, please go ahead, hit that subscribe button and join the Wheezy Wig Review family. We would love to have you here. All right, y'all, I'm going to show y'all this wig. Let me know what y'all think about it in the comments, okay? Let go. Black boy joy, she want to see the forbs like I want to see her form. Tell me what you fought, yeah. I think Utre tried to do something that I've been wanting wig companies to do forever. Although mine looks like it got a little damaged or something, but I don't know. But it looks like, see this white piece of paper? It was kind of sewn right onto the cap, kind of hidden back a little like that, like where, like where it could be tucked away. And guess what this says on it? It says Freya. See that? It's got the name of the wig on it. How neat is that if they start putting these tags in the wig so that when your wigs get mixed up or like when you wash them or whatever, you'll know which wig it is. Girl, that's been my struggle. But oh my God, that would be so awesome. Although I'm going to have to cut this out because mine is literally just hanging on by a thread. But that is going to be fabulous if that's what they finna start doing. <laughs> Good job, Utre. Now, if you could just sew them on here so that they stay, I'll be winning. <laughs> All right, let's keep going.
Okay. Bad little flex, she wanna know me. I stay low key, I'll cast no breaks, baby. Let them hoes sleep. Body on ten, make your girl OD. I get in my way, never out of my lane. Feel like you the one and I'm on one. So what is gonna be? Baby squad up, we finna go deep. Riding on a team, got what you need. Baby, won't you keep me company? Give me something to do when I get low. Think you should side with me Stay solid one time If you lie with me Just promise you never lie to me Okay, so this is my final look <sighs> Alright, alright So let me tell you guys what Utre says about it first And then I'll tell you what I think Okay, so this is the new color that Utre is introducing It is a DRFF6 Honey Over Brown I don't know, y'all. I, I couldn't really make that one make sense for me because I like what I like about Outre is when they blend the colors. And that one, they just. I don't know how I feel about that, you all. Because what I love about Outre is their ability to blend colors seamlessly. And that's just kind of harsh to me. So, you know, I'm sure it's going to be cute on somebody, but I wasn't quite ready for that yet. I don't know. It just color, it, it seemed like a color bomb color. Like it should be in the color bomb line. But anyway, girl, what do I know? She is ear to ear lace, they were saying. Um, and pre-plucked hairline. Mm, okay, let me just say this. If you are a beginner or you're a lazy wig wearer, you guys, the perfect hairline is not going to be a wig that you can just plop on your head and go. She requires some work. Although they say pre-plucked hairline, if you want her to look flawless, you're definitely going to have to go in and pluck her a little more to obtain that totally flawless look. You can wear her glueless, but your, your lace is going to flap in the wind, you know, on the sides here. And I did show you guys um, on Outre's Everett how to kind of conceal that lace. If you do want to wear the wig glueless, um, I showed you a little hack. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, go back and watch that Outre Everett review. I will leave a link here. Or she does have the wide elastic band, so it's going to help it lay flatter on your head. She does have six specialty colors, and I did show those to you earlier. Now, let me spill my tea. <laughs> she did come down ear to ear on me. This side I already lifted up. Um, and tangling so i did get a lot of tangling with her you guys and as you can see like when i run my fingers through her i do get snags so she is a tangler um when you comb through her at the bottom she's a tangler and she does kind of look a little worn at the bottom so what i'm planning to do is i'm going to go in with my hot curlers just on the tips and i'm going to curl those and that's going to give it a more um you know, like a, not a worn look. It's going to make it look more new and put together. So that is what I'm planning to do with that. I'll probably do it and just show you on Instagram. So with that said, if you're not following me on Instagram, what are you doing with yourself? Make sure you go over there and check me out at Wheezy Wig Reviews on Instagram as well. As far as Big Head Friendly, I would say, yeah, I would say Big Head Associate. Although she has enough lace to go ear to ear, her cap isn't that big. So if you have, I have a 23 inch head with my grip cap on and she is fitting me with no problem. She is a shatter, you guys, but let me just preference that with saying I did go in and pluck her a lot. This is how much hair I did pluck out of her, out of my um, hairline. And as well as I did combine it with some of the shedding that I got. So this is how much hair that has come out since I've plucked her. Okay, so she is going to be a little bit of a shatter. So just know that you are going to need to have some kind of comb or something with you because she is going to tangle on the ends. But is she a look? 
Absolutely. Do you have styling options with her? Absolutely. You guys saw I showed her to you in a right side part, a middle part, and a left part. So you are able to do all of those things as well as if you wanted to do a up down style, sis, you could do that as well very easily with no problem. And I'm sorry about all the noise. I don't know what my family doing upstairs. I would say on a scale of 1 to 10, with 10 being the best wig ever, I would probably give her a 9.875. <laughs> I really like this wig. I do like her even better than Everett, only because, oh, that's why I didn't tell you guys her texture. So she does have a little yackiness in her, but she is more of a silky texture, you guys. So she's not that, you know, here, let me spunk it. See, she does have some yackiness in her, but she is more of a, she's slacky. That's what she is, slacky, okay? So, I don't know. I still love her. I love her. I love her. And y'all, I gotta work on my lights. I feel like my lights are too bright. I gotta get me a new chair because this bad boy is squeaking. <laughs> and I'm just, I'm, I'm, I, I gotta get my life together over right, here. That's all I have to say about this wig. I hope you've enjoyed this review. Go ahead, give me a thumbs up. Share it with somebody that you think would enjoy it. And you guys have a very blessed week. And remember, sis, what I always say to show somebody. A little piece of heaven today. This is Wheezy, the sexy grandma 2K, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye! Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 Bad little flex, she wanna know me. I stay low key, all gas, no brakes, baby. Let them hoes sleep. Body on ten, make your girl OD. I get in my way, never out of my lane. Feel like you the one in the morning.